Adam Sturgeon has been a working musician and record producer in London for the last four years. Local band. He maintains that London's music scene lacks the economic support and popularity for most musicians to make a proper living. There, there are so many benefits to living in London, but again, you sort of feel a little bit isolated when you're trying to do something interesting and unique, and you have to work kind of, um, you know, jobs that you don't necessarily want to be working when you could be working in the music industry. The good news for Adam and other local musicians is that Mayor Fontana has some ambitious goals for London's music industry. I want to make London the place to be for all things music. At the urging of Music Canada and its president, Graham Henderson, London City Council has approved the formation of a city music task force. London's music scene is a far more important asset than Londoners probably imagine. And if they can look at it differently uh, as a means of generating tourism, uh, attracting and retaining talented young people, uh, and as sort of an economic engine, uh, then uh, that would be the takeaway. This music task force will be designed to improve London's music industry through promotion and financial support. Both Henderson and Fontana believe this will improve the city's popularity and economic standing. It's good economics, it's good cultural policy, why wouldn't we want to do it? And so the sooner the better. It is clear that both President Henderson and Mayor Fontana believe that London is a city ready to become a music industry powerhouse. However, the working musicians of London still believe there is much work that needs to be done. It's just way too corporate, like it's um, old dinosaurs sort of running the running the, the financial um, portion of, of the music and I don't have a problem with, with that music but it's just not all that cultural. It's not gonna draw young people to London. You can't draw people with an orchestra. For Inside London, I'm Daryl Evans.